So as you guys can see, black background, and it works the same for the smoke back. You would just want to put the compositing mode to the right settings. What's happening guys? My name is Alex and welcome to the last uh, After Effects tutorial of the day. Today guys, I'm gonna show you guys, well in the last video, I'm gonna show you guys how to make a fire effect, you know, like you wanna spice up. Dude, in the last tutorial, like two hours ago, there, there were also freaking 10,000 birds flying by. I don't know what the deal is, dude. Struggles. Anyway, back to the video. So today I'm gonna show you guys how to make the fire effect. You know that you wanna have some like some nice fire in the screen to spice up the video. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do that right now. So I would say let's just let's don't waste any time here and let's jump straight into, into the video. Alright everyone, so as you guys can see, we are in After Effects, and I'm gonna show you guys how to make the fire effect and you know put like the fire onto the video track like with no black background so the first thing you want to do is you want to go to youtube and the thing you want to look for is you want to you know type in the search bar fire black background like this boom and as you guys can see we have all kinds of uh, fire uh, videos as you guys can see we have this one which is sort of like a sort of a campfire but i just want to have like more like this that is you know from the bottom so this one looks nice so i'm going to download this one so i'm just going to copy the link and i'm going to use the free program free make video converter as you guys can see right here i'm just going to paste in the link boom it's that simple you convert it to any kind of format you want actually i'm just going to pick mp4 i want to have like 10 and nice 10 and phd i'm going to choose where i want to save this which is actually fire file which is the fire map which is this one i'm just gonna call this a fire boom click on save convert and now the clip is converting as you guys can see it goes really fast it depends on how fast your internet connection is but that is basically how simple and how fast you can converse like convert a uh, feed a video from youtube actually so what you want to do is you want to go back to after effects okay we're back on after effects and the thing you need to do or for thing you want to do is you want to drag in your uh, fire clip like right here in this section so i'm going to do that right now as you guys can see i dragged in the actual uh clip the fire you know the fire clip so what i'm going to do is i'm going to put this one in the timeline as you guys can see boom and as you guys can see, the, the fire track is below this one. So you want to just change the order. So you want to click on this and you want to hold your mouse, drag it down as you can see until so the black line appears, boom. And there we have the fire. So what you want to do is, first of all, uh, you want to stretch it until it, like, it fits the screen. So that's what I'm going to do right now. Boom, that looks pretty good. So let's see how it looks, the fire right by itself. It looks pretty good, it looks pretty nice. So as you guys can see, there is just, you know, the black background and it works the same for the smoke effect. You just want to you just want to put the compositing mode to the right settings. The only thing you need to do is you want to drag in your, fo your fire, as you can see. You want to go to mode, well, it, it is compositing mode. It says like blending mode in After Effects, but I'm used to compositing mode from Sony Vegas. So we're just going to pick the blending mode. You see this entire list and you want to put this one to screen and pay attention to what happens to this video preview. Bam! There we freaking go. And as you guys can see, you can actually, it's trying to render, but uh, as you guys can see, the fire is like really nice in the screen and you can make something look like that is freaking on fire. It looks like that I'm recording in fire almost. As you can see, like, you know, at my arms and stuff, it looks really good because it's like black of my chair, like under my arms. So it takes away, it takes away the black. That is basically how you can add in the fire effect. And I'm not going to show you guys like how to make the fire look like better contrast or make the fire... Um, th more thick or any of that stuff. I'm just gonna show you guys how to do this and how to make the background disappear from like a uh, clip with a black background. That is basically how you can add in the fire effects. It's really simple, guys. I know. And that is basically how simple it is. That's basically how simple it is, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for liking and commenting on this video. Make sure to smash the like and the subscribe button down below for more videos actually on every Monday at 3.30 and 5.30 p.m. PST on Just Alex Alpha. Same time, same channel uh, for our two After Effects tutorials. I'll see you guys tomorrow for two OBS tutorials. And then Wednesday, of course, with two awesome ass-kicking Point of Vegas tutorials. And then the schedule just continues. And, that, and you, basically, you guys know how it rolls. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys, thank you guys for, the, for the continued support. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. In about uh, four episodes, it's going to be the 22nd of May, and then I find something else. When I started using video editing software, it was like, I have my own Patreon page. You have fucking troll. Channelpages.com. Kind of nice weather. And I'm a tie with just Alex Halford. You know, yes. it's his channel, so that's a bit of a logic.